Hi guys, uh, just a quick one. Um, a student was asking me how to do like voiceovers and stuff without using the character. What you can do, if you look on the bottom left, there's add a voiceover. If you click on that, a few options come up. So record voiceover, text to speech. Um, so you could actually just record over your vo uh, record a voice and then put it, implement it into your videos. Or you can use text to speech if you don't want to use your voice. It's pretty cool actually. So I'll be like, hello my dudes. Uh, change the voice to female. Let's have it British English, of course. And Emma sounds fine. Let's play that. So that's what that sounds like. Or uh, Amy. I'll stick to Emma. Then we can sync that up. Syncing audio. Like so. And then if I just press play. Brilliant. Look at that. I'm going to show you a quick video uh, on how you can lower the sound and have the voice higher. So, for instance, I'm going to take it to slide 20 and I'm going to add, first I'll add music like you have. I'm going to drag that out. So if we actually press on the music here, Celebration Festival, if you press on it, there's this button here, volume, press that, have that really low. I think this one's perfectly fine. And then... What you can do is your text to speech. As you can see, I am higher. If you uh, just start messaging me for one second, I'll get back to you. And yeah, we'll use your breathing technique, which you taught me. Good stuff. And then sync that up. So now, if I press play, uh, so that we can first double check, sound, sound is full, that's fine. So now if I press play. As you can see, I am higher. So as you heard, the music, uh, the voice is higher than the music, So and it's nice because it gives a background filtering noise rather than just sounding, hearing your voice, because it can get boring, especially if it's a child watching it. So you want to add more engagement to the video.